Hey guys, this is another Game Find video here. I managed to pick up a bundle of Xbox 360 games, a few PS2 games, and a SNES. I paid 20 quid. I'm going to start from the beginning with the best start. I paid 20 quid for the SNES. It came with two controllers. It came with a battery pack and the lead to the TV. Um, it's fully working. Only worry is that the start button on both of these have been clawed so there's a little bit of damage there but apart from that they are in great condition the facebook side of things i managed to pick up these for 20 quid as well so i picked up ratchery which is selling for a decent amount of money still um i'm guessing it's down to the disney name skyrim a favorite to most xbox gamers that i know rayman origins you can't go wrong with a rayman game an avatar um, I've been told that's a half decent game I might give it a try out later went into cash converters after buying the snares and picked up a sports game being the Olympics game for 39p now it's a shelf filler but I haven't got it and for 39p it was in good condition with a booklet uh, MMA and Sega Superstar Tennis they cost me I think it was three pounds yeah 298 for the two you know the, for the prices I paid for them three games I paid you know three pounds 40 basically for three Xbox games you just can't say no to that and the ps2 games as you can see I paid 29p each and they were the Mortal Kombat game Starsky and Hutch there's a Lord of the Ring game in it uh, Medal of Honor and Max Payne, and I paid one pound fifty for a lot. That's bus fare to work. I'm sure I can sell them for a pound each at least. You know, five a profit there. Can't say no. So yeah, basically I paid pretty much forty five quid on that lot. That alone, I would sell for thirty to forty quid. So I just need to make a little bit of profit out of that, basically.